Yo, what's good, everybody, man? We are back with another day of Doula, another day being charged up, and today we are doing something different. We are doing a video where we're gonna see what if every NBA player stayed in their home state and they played for the team that like in, in the state they were raised in, they play for that team. So we're here in 2K23 and I decided to start the year in 2014 for a reason because a lot of like players that we know today that are gonna be in this video, they're in their mid 20s. So I feel like this is a good starting point for it. So every team has uh, their, you know, their best players. Now these rosters, the way I have it set up is like, I took two or three or four of the best players from every state. I didn't put, it's not completely accurate, bro. No way I'm putting, uh, no way I'm putting Ish Smith in, in on, like, I don't care. You know what I mean? We're, we care about the stars. So, for example, Philadelphia has Kobe Bryant, uh, you know, Kyle Lowry, and Tyreek Evans. They're all from Philly, so I put them all on this team. In the ages, you know, I made them younger. You know, it's not perfect. And then, like, Chicago has Anthony Davis, Derrick Rose, Dwayne Wade, Jabari Parker. This is actually be a lot of fun. Before we get into it, though, man, drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel. This is, like, a new idea I just thought of, and, and hopefully you guys like it. If you have any other suggestions you want to see in the comments below, let me know. Let's get into it. Now, this is where I got it from. A lot of my, like the help, the resource I use is this website. They had like a chart that showed like every team, the best players. So, you know, I'll, let's just go through it real quick, man. KD and Carmelo, the best players out of Washington. So uh, if we go back to 2K real quick. Wizards have Kevin Durant, Carmelo Anthony. I put Isaiah Thomas on this team. Uh, IT is actually from Seattle and Seattle's Washington. It'd be the Seattle Supersonics, but they're the Thunder. I decided to put IT on Washington instead. Um, and then Charlotte, they actually have a lot of guards. Chris Paul, I didn't know he's from Charlotte or from, uh, you know, North Carolina. And then same with Steph Curry and then John Wall. Some players I put like if they're uh, next to a team at like the closest state they're in next to a team, I put them on that team. Like for example, DeMarcus Cousins is from Alabama. So I put Atlanta, uh, Atlanta Hawks is, is, you know, the closest team to him. We got Dwight Howard on this team as well. So let's go back to this chart. I like the, the visuals, it's easier here. So New York has Jakeem Noah, Kyrie Irving, uh, Kemba Walker, we put J.R. Smith. Dallas has Chris Bosh. The Lakers had DeMar DeRozan. I'm pretty sure I put, uh, I think I put Paul George on this team as well. Klay Thompson. Indiana, Zach Randolph. LeBron literally is the only person in Cleveland, so tough scene for him. And then uh, who else? Golden State has Damian Lillard because he's from Oak Oakland. So yeah, we have him and Jeremy Lin. And Toronto got Andrew Wiggins, Tristan Thompson. I know Steve Nash is from uh, Canada as well, but at, you know, 2014 he retired. Um, let's see the rest of this. Portland has Kevin Love. Detroit has Draymond Green. And that's really about it, man. You know, OKC has Blake Griffin. That's about it, though. Matter of fact, comment down below if uh, what team would you be on? So considering, like, you know, your home state, like, what team would you be playing for? Obviously, me, I'm Michigan. I'd be playing for the Pistons. Um, yeah, so where, where would you guys be? Nowadays, I feel like LA, like, California has all the best prospects, so it'd probably be, like, an LA team. But let's get into it, man. We'll just simulate some seasons, and we'll see how, uh, you know, how this pans out. Let's start by simulating a few weeks. And the NBA is gonna look completely different, so I'm interested to see. I feel like my prediction is that um, my prediction is gonna be the Lakers being the best team. I think. Okay, so 30 games in, Philadelphia is doing worse than I thought. 11 and 19. Let's see who are the best. Well, I gotta show you guys the Lakers as well. Sorry, we're kind of all over the place, man. Also, injuries will be off for this video just so we can see how these teams pan out without injuries getting in the way. So Lakers have Kawhi Leonard, actually. But yeah, we took Kawhi to LA, Paul George, Klay Thompson, and DeMar DeRozan. I imagine they have the best record, so let's actually see the standings here. And no, oh, okay, okay, so here, here's how it looks. New York and Chicago and Portland and Houston. Houston has Jimmy Butler, that's where he uh, he's from. Damn, so New York is the best team in the league. That's interesting, I wanna check them, check them out real quick. So Kyrie Irving, he's dropping how many points a game right now? 23, Kemba also at point guard, he's dropping 20 points a game. Jakeem's averaging 18 rebounds a game, what? He got 26 reasons in one game before, but how is he? Yeah, 24 rebounds, 16, 23. I know we've only played like a couple months, but still. Bro's averaging almost 20 reads a game, what the hell? And then J.R. Smith, how's he looking, bro? I feel like J.R. Smith, I mean, he's a walking bucket. Yeah, he's putting up cool 16. And you may be wondering, what about players like Tim Duncan or foreign players? Where did I put them? Well, I left, like for example, for the Spurs, I left um, Tim Duncan and, and Tony Park, since they're you know very uh, diverse team here. I left them on the same team. I didn't really make changes. No one of, of like importance is from San Antonio. So we just kept it as is. I wonder how Draymond Green is doing in Detroit. 13 and 10 and eight assists. They still putting up good numbers. All right, well, it looks like, it looks like the Knicks are gonna win it. Low key win the whole thing, but I mean, one step at a time. Let's go to All-Star Weekend. All right, the best players in the league. Let's take a look. So it's, uh, let's actually look at the stats. Let's see who's averaging the most now on, on their new teams. We got LeBron averaging 32 points and 11 rebounds, and he's a 
by far the first place. Eric Bledsoe on the Suns averaging 26. Damian Lillard averaging 26 in Golden State. Got Harden in the Clippers. Um, okay. We got K-Love averaging 24 and 12. Double-double machine. If you know, you know. Curry's averaging 24. Dope. I mean, it looks like everything's going well. Westbrook and Harden is a good duo in, uh, in, in, in the Clippers, it looks like. But let's see who's in the three-point contest. Curry, K-Love, Dame, and LeBron James in the three-point contest. Whoa, okay. What about dunk contest? Who's in here? LeBron. Wow. LeBron, Vic, Zach, and then Gordon. Okay. I'm not going to play. I'm only going to uh, hop in the, in the playoff games. But so far, this is interesting, man. I feel like the goal should be to whatever team uh, goes back-to-back -back finals first wins. I, I think that's, that should be the challenge. So LeBron still wins MVP, averaging 31, 10, and 8. Okay, he's carrying Wiggins, Rookie of the Year in, uh, in Toronto, which happened in real life. He won Rookie of the Year. John Wall, sixth man in Charlotte. Keep in mind, they have three-point guards, so that makes sense. He's still putting up 19 points. LeBron, Defensive Player of the Year, and Hassan, Most Improved. Wow, so we have Harden, Westbrook, Davis, DeMarcus Cousins. I wonder what the Clippers record is. Um, and then Dame, Carmelo, Paul Millsap is from New Orleans. So yeah, 90 overall, Jakeem Noah. Well, let's look at the seedings now. The first seed in the West is the Spurs, which is, you know, Tim Duncan and them. So that didn't really change. But the Hawks are the first seed in the East. And that is very surprising. So check this out. The Hawks went 61 and 21. New York went 16 and 22. Bulls did their thing, Hornets. Wizards kind of underwhelmed me. I thought uh, KD and Carmelo would go crazy, but only a fifth seed. And then Philadelphia with Kobe, Kobe and uh, Kyle Lowry just wasn't enough. And LeBron missed the playoffs, so that's how bad his team was. In the Western Conference, Lakers are the second seed. The Clippers missed the playoffs. Wow. They missed it because they had a worse road record or division record? No. Yeah, uh, conference record, I think, is why they missed it, because they're tied. But damn. So Dallas... Portland, Houston, LA, and San Antonio. So Dame couldn't get far, Golden State, and, and Blake Griffin couldn't get far with the Thunder. So we'll simulate the first round completely, and we'll see who goes where. We got one upset so far. So New York gets swept by the Bucks, and the Bucks have Paul Gasol and Giannis. So that mean Kyrie, they just didn't do enough. Tough scene. Atlanta and Charlotte advance, it's Chicago, Milwaukee, LA and Houston, San Antonio and Portland. Okay. I'm going to guess it's going to be San Antonio and LA up against Atlanta and Chicago. That's my guess. And no. Whoa. So K-Love and the Blazers advanced in game seven. And then now Milwaukee. Who's on their team exactly? They have Paul Gasol. I just put him on the team because he was just, you know, I made trades manually. So he just ended up here. It doesn't mean anything. He's a foreign player. But Chris Middleton and a, a young Giannis... I'm surprised, bro. Not gonna lie to you. Now, Lakers, it has to be Lakers and Hawks, right? I mean, it has to be. Yeah, Hawks sweep them and, and the Lakers went 4 1. Okay. Atlanta and LA. You know, fun fact about Atlanta, they're becoming like the new LA, you know? Not really. But Atlanta has Demarcus Cousins, who's putting up 24 and 10. Dwight Howard putting up only 15 and 10 in the playoffs. And of course, you know, Lou Williams. Uh, so we have him every 19. And the Lakers with, I mean, the Lakers are stacked, bro. PG-13, Kawhi, Clay, and DeMar DeRozan. A bunch of forwards and guards. No point guards or centers. But a bunch of 6'7", six, 6'8", six, guys on the court. Game by game it. Game one, the Hawks win it. 1-1. One, 2-1. One, 3-1. One, one, and simulate with Simcast here and see who wins it the first year. Is LA about to get a ring? It's funny because, like, every offseason, everyone says, like, how LA's going to get all these players they never do. But when they all stay at home, they are winning a ring, 124 to 104. Damn. Kawhi dropped 30. George had 27. Clay had 26. Damn, they all cooked up for real. And they win a ring. Paul George finals MVP. Bro, I wish he came to LA, him or Kawhi. Uh, the Lakers. It would have. <laughs> bro, LeBron would be so happy. So season one under. Under, it's, it's, it's over. Let's keep on going. Now I want to check out uh, how like the power rankings. They think LA's first and Cleveland second, just because off LeBron and then Chicago. Okay, interesting. I mean, I don't. I mean, I mean, I don't know if Cleveland really has has that much you know to work with unless we drafted someone. And it's can. Oh wow, and it's Cantor and LeBron is the best duo. That is a. Uh, you know, that's kind of crazy. What are the odds of that, right? But yeah, I made sure I signed everyone for like at least a few years so they stay on, on their teams just to save me a headache. But yeah, maybe, maybe I, I feel like things are going to change this season. I feel like things will like go different here. All-star break. Once once again, let's see the standings. 
Is it the same thing? No, it's, oh, see how it's different now? We got Bulls first, but New York drops to fourth, and Atlanta is third. Okay, in the Western Conference, LA's, LA back at it, man, 38 and seven. How, what? Um, how did the Blazers play seven more games than us already? Bro, Lakers must have had like a lot of breaks or something, because they play way less games than everyone else. Uh, I don't know if you caught that. Okay, yeah, second half of the season is way more packed for him, I was gonna say. Look at all these back-to-back -back games. Who's leading the league currently? Steph Curry is. So where did LeBron go? He's dipped down to 26 points. So Curry, Lillard, LeBron, Kyrie, James y Yo, James Young, I forgot about him. He's the left-handed player from, uh, I think, UNC. Yeah, he's in Boston. K-Love, still doing his thing. Durant, only 25 points. Carmelo, where's he at? Melo. 21 points. All right, man, let's continue on. I'm, I'm hopping to games in this playoffs for sure, though. Oh, man, by the way, um, if you guys aren't already following me on Instagram and Twitter, bro, I think I'm dropping like a sponsored, it's like an EA thing, uh, sponsored on my Instagram reels. So yeah, man, if you aren't already following me, go show some support on that, man. That, that'll help and, and that'll help me a lot. So I'd appreciate that. Um, It's on my Instagram. I'm DulaYT. I'm DulaYT. So on the, on the bottom screen of the quarter, you'll see my IG. Go ahead and drop a like on that post and stuff, bro. You know, that, that helps a lot. And I appreciate the support as always, guys. Anthony Davis wins MVP. Wow, that's a first. Kemba's sixth man of the year with 20 points a game. Brown's still a defensive player. And yeah, most improved James Young. Okay, and things look uh, a little different. Yeah, the Spurs are the eighth seed now. And Bulls are first seed. So let's go ahead and see what this first round real quick. Now I like this. Okay, I can live with this. We have LA and Portland, Houston and, and Clippers, Bulls and Raptors, and Knicks and Hawks. I'm gonna guess it's gonna be Lakers and Clippers, which would be fire. And then Bulls and Hawks. It's my guess. No. Oh, okay. So with the first and second seed, it worked out perfectly, I guess. Let's just check out that Rockets team real quick. You can see our team, Lakers, doing really well. Um, and then Rockets have Drew Holiday. I don't think he's from there. I know Butler is, though. They didn't really have anyone. When I searched them up, they didn't really have anyone, so I left, left it as is. Um, but Butler, he averaged 20 points so far. Bulls and Knicks is a good one, though. I think they had, had a rivalry back in the day, day too, like when Derrick Rose was playing and Carmelo. But Kyrie's a 95 overall, averaging 26. Kemba putting up 15. Jakeem with 14 rees. Then MVP Anthony Davis with 26 points. Derrick Rose, he's still putting up 20. And Wade with 20. Jabari with 15. Everyone's doing good, bro. This is going to be a good one. Let's actually focus on the East, Eastern. Game by game, that one. 2-1. Two, 3-1. One. One. Damn. Okay. So Bulls and Lakers, something different. Can the Lakers go back to back or can the can AD and the Bulls win a ring here? It's a good matchup. I like it. Lakers take game one. Damn, no way they're going to sweep them, bro. Wow. All right, let's jump in just, just to check it out. I thought the Bulls would put up a good fight. Like, you know, AD, the Lakers do have a lot of wings. Okay. All right, the Bulls win this one. Yeah, Davis had 29 and 21. If they come back down 3-0, that'd be the craziest feat ever. And it looks like we're going to win this game. I think think let's uh let's jump in let's just watch it i mean i feel like derrick rose going to the basket left hand late but him and ad's already a great duo then you take in dwayne wade and jabari parker more buckets like i could see him coming back play thompson pulling up for three missing it yeah all right there's no point in you know, us watching the rest but i just want to see the stats so clay had 20 yeah okay so everyone did decent something no, on demar wasn't horrible davis had 27 wade had 20 you see what i'm saying like Everyone's putting up good stuff. Let's see if they can complete the comeback. So they're down 3-0. Can we make it 3-3? We're playing at home in Chicago, bro. At the United Center. Come on now. I think we have it. Oh, it's a close one. Definitely when I'm jumping in. Yeah, jumping in right now. Uh, right now. Perfect. Down by seven. Three minutes left. Do they have Sim Bular? Uh, no. Satnam Singh Bahamara. Look at that standing dunk he just did, bro. He, how tall is this dude? 7-2 from IMG Academy. Hey, yo, what? <laughs> that's crazy. Okay, well, I mean, look, bro. Kawhi had 28. Damar is 25. It's not over, but that's not good. I don't see Anthony Davis either. Hold on. If he fouled out, I'm going to shoot myself in the face, bro. I swear. He uh, has three fouls. Put him in the game, coach. Derrick Rose pulling up contested. Uh, oh, my God. He hit that shit. Okay. My bad. Not over, bro. Six points. Three minutes left. Plenty of time. Wade guarding on Clay. Clay. That ain't you, bro. Ah! Where's Davis at, bro? We had, if we had Davis in the game, he's not getting that put back. Here we go, Davis checked in for the Bulls. Love to see it. Number 11 on the court. 
Go crazy. Oh my god, y'all are retarded. Retarded. Damn. Come on, man. I mean, he just passed it. In. All right. 10 point game. Rose, wide open, bucket. You got Rose guarding George. That's not a good mismatch. Good steal. Zarball. Yes. For the sake of the Bulls going to game seven, I want to see this win. Come on now. Rose getting a screen. Okay. Paints open. Good pass. Smith, I don't know who you are, but you're a bucket. Big shot, boy. Play. He's going to the paint. Now we're on that. Nah. AD, bro, help. AD, help. Damn. Come on, bro. Help, AD. <laughs> no way he's that good. All right. Great screen. Good midi. Yes. Ice in his veins, bro. That's D Rose for you. He has 29 points. Play. Nope. Nope. Bro. No way he finished that on Anthony Davis. Come on, Rose. No, no, no. Pass, pass, pass. One more. Davis, he's going to the basket. Way to draw a foul in the bonus now. All right, we got just over a minute left. Clay, I mean, Clay, he's playing like a ball hand. I don't know why he's playing the way he is. Bad shot. Oh my God, man, seven points. We need a three. Oh, good floater, good putback. We're still in it. Double team, yeah, yeah. No, 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 Kawhi. Yes, let's go, five points, 40 seconds left. Wade, attack, 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 attack. Throwing it up to Davis. What a ballsy play. Whoa, all right, down by three, we're still in it. We have life. Thought we had a steal. Okay, clamps up, we don't got a foul just yet. Okay, now we do. Clay misses the first. All right, bruh, lock in. Lock in real quick. Clay, second free throw. He made it. Down by four. We have one timeout left, bro. We don't need a two, all right, we don't need a three. I prefer, I definitely prefer open three, but we don't need to force nothing, okay. Davis, Wade, for three! Oh, you bitch! What's wrong with you? I am disgusted with what I just saw. Wade is not a three-point shooter. I don't know what that was. Uh, we could have had a good two-point opportunity, but instead, we're just gonna, what are we doing? Go to three-point line? Fade, bro, what's wrong with you? Ah, oh, man. That's a wrap, and we lost. Ah, man. Lakers go back to back. I mean, it took their four best players all dropping at least 26. Like, they earned it. But this is fun. Paul George, back-to-back -back finals MVP. Maybe he should have went to LA after all. Let's, let's go, run it back another season. Lakers end up having another great season, winning 65, wait, hold on. Yeah, 65 games. LeBron wins MVP again, though. Or, uh, yeah, he wins the second MVP now. Simmons, rookie of the year. He still ends up in Philly, funny enough. And, okay. It's funny, because if I turn injuries on, <laughs> This team, this team would be actually be the worst team because Kawhi wouldn't play, Paul George, I mean, Clay, you never know with him, bro. Like, yeah. So, luckily, injuries are off. That's helping a lot. The Knicks, though, they're still crushing things. Let's see. Uh, so, it's the same thing, it looks like. Yeah. It's like it's like a, a, a replay of last season in terms of seeding. Oh, I lied. So, LeBron and Cleveland, they went to the second round. They beat the Hawks. And the Bulls beat the Raptors. Knicks beat the Pistons. Lakers are back at it. Here we go. Summit again. Will it be a rematch of the finals? Let's find out. It looks like it could be. The East, man, the sixth and eighth seed in the conference finals. Let's see the lead leaders in the playoffs. AD putting up 30 and 13. Uh, LeBron putting up 27 and 12. Okay. And then the Lakers are going to be spread out. Who do the Mavericks have? Marcus Aldridge and Chris Bosch and Darren Williams and Marcus Smart. Yeah, they're all decent. They're all pretty good. Okay. My prediction is once again, Lakers and Bulls. I think that's what's gonna happen here. All right, well, it's 2-2, two, two. hold on, hold on. So it's 3-2. Lakers and Bulls both have the advantage here. Let's see what happens. All right, Bulls advance and the Lakers also advance. It's, it's a rematch of the finals, bro. I mean, this team is, this team, I got the Bulls winning this year, bro. I got, I got the Bulls winning. Here we go, game one, Lakers. No, damn, oh my God, swept them. It's over, bro. If everyone played in their home state, the Lakers would by far be the best team. Unreal. Let's do one more season and see if things change. We'll see how, how many rings in a row they could win. All right, man. Lakers are back in the first seed. We're going to summit the playoffs entirely. And my guess is that they will uh, four-peat, technically. Wouldn't it be a four-peat? Yo, okay. Lakers and Hawks. I got Lakers sweeping them. And they win 4-2. All right, bro. <laughs> it's over. It's over. So that's what would happen. If every player played in their home team, uh, in their home state, the Lakers, and it makes sense. California has the best high school basketball, the best prospects, so it makes a lot of sense. The Lakers win it, bro. They uh, <laughs> crushed them. Too bad they can't be like that in real life, man.
Hey, hope you enjoyed the video. Something different. Just want to try it out, and it was pretty. I enjoyed doing it, man. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel. I catch you tomorrow, man. Peace.